Welcome to the team sheet tutorial. Double click the spreadsheet that has the number of players on your team. Since my team is 4 players, I'll click team size 4. To edit it, click file and then make a copy. And then I'll just save it to my drive. Because this is only a round of 16 tournament, we can hide some unnecessary sheets by right clicking and clicking hide sheet. The next thing to do is to head over to settings and put the names of your teammates in. I'll just name them A, B, C, and D for now. The next thing to do is to find the actual map pool. Since this is the qualifiers map pool, I'm going to be putting information for the qualifiers row. So the name of the sheet is called map pools at the bottom. Copy it exactly. The first map row is Nomad 1. So this is row 3. And the last map row is DT2, which is row 12. Next, we want to set the columns. The mod column is column B. The song column is column D. It's already set. The bmap ID column is column I. And because there's no map pack, we can ignore these two rows for now. Last thing is to put the main spreadsheet link in. We can just copy and paste it right in here. All the information for the qualifiers should now be present because we put the information for the qualifiers row. To put scores in, look at these four boxes here. I can get 100k, for example, 300k, uh, 400k, and a million. The box above is the average. Don't edit them. Just fill in the scores below in the four boxes. The column feel is a number from 1 to 10 that shows how comfortable you are on the map. So if I'm pretty comfortable, I can probably put a 9. And so the description, you can leave some comments about the map, and a lineup. You can choose what players are going to play each map for the tournament. We have the availability sheet, which is a schedule that can show what times overlap for your teammates to try out or play a match. So right now it's in UTC, but since this is a New York tournament, we want to click File, Settings, and then we'll change the time zone to UTC minus 5, which is Eastern time. And just to make it look better, we'll just change plus zero to minus five for each of them. You can copy and paste the colors to show availability. Finally, we want to actually share the sheet with our teammates. We can click share and then change to anyone with the link. Then we can copy the link and send it to our teammates. To actually make it so your teammates can edit the sheet, change viewer to editor. This is how to use the team spreadsheet. 